because I really just need to get to the top and be on the second floor when I get there. So. And of course. Of course. I think there's actually a ladder in here, though. That's good. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Get out. And that's... I like their attention to detail, how you can smash the pottery. That really is a nice touch. Oh, and not swinging, even though we never actually... Oh, I guess we did actually touch it, didn't we? Never mind. Version preview window still. Oh, it's going. Albeit very slowly. And I hope my computer doesn't blue screen of death on me when I try to export this. Oh, what you have to say? Aha, I've got it. In order to reach the top. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll have to find the room right below the tower. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. And see the tower from yet another angle. Because, you know, seeing it from like 15 already isn't quite enough. Yeah, it's usually fine for recording, but it seems to blue screen of death when I try to export for some reason. I have no idea why. Oh wow, that's where I need to get. Ah, this is gonna be fun. Hopefully no rats come from nowhere. Whoa, I almost got spotted. <laughs> this is fun. Turn around. Por favor. Thank you. Turn, turn, turn. Come on. Now I just have to get by without being seen by this guard. Come on. There we go. And I think we're in the clear. I think that's about all we need to get there. So let's head up these stairs. And I must admit, for not having played this game recently, I'm doing pretty well. Oh crap. I have to do some more sneaky sneaky. That was close. Come on, turn around. Ah, you tricky devil. Just start walking, please. Thank you. Walk faster, you stinky pig. Ah, uh, moblins. What can you do? And I think that's the last enemy. But I, for one, do not care to find out the hard way. So I'm going to walk up there in my barrel. So, moving right along, slowly, but surely. Walking, walking, okay. We're gonna have to do some sidling. Oh wow, this is going to take forever. Link cannot sidle very fast at all. And I must be dyslexic or something, because the whole first couple times I played this game I thought that said slide. So yeah, spare hearts, which I don't really need, but I guess I could use one of the two. Yeah. 
so continue to sidle. 16 minutes, so this might go into three parts. That would suck. I've really got 22, though. Oh. There's the sword. Yay! Oh, crap. And where did he come from? He wasn't there two seconds ago. You got a sword. Okay, now you're just gonna die. And just to add insult to injury, I'm gonna kill you with your own sword. Now let's throw this over the side. While the magical enchanted lock opens up. Another glitch. Whatever, let's get in here. Super Link away! Oh wow, 17 minutes I've captured already. Oh, there's a jail cell with three girls in it. Our sister, some rich, spoiled brat, and someone who looks like they are rather less fortunate. Wait a minute. And here's a bird. Everybody's heard about the bird. Oh well, the bird, 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 the bird, bird's the word. Uh oh. Link just got eated by the bird. And it's taken us away. Giant evil birds, what can you do with them? Okay, 18 minutes. I've got to hope I can't find a place to stop in the next four. <clears throat> oh, and about Mother One, and they're not having been apart recently. I am in my least favorite 10 minute segment of the whole series. So as soon as I get around to recording that, they will start coming in drones, but. or droves, I think is the right word. But until then, it's gonna be all Wind Waker. So once I get the next part of Mother One recorded, it will continue with as my main LP, but for now, it's all Wind Waker all day. And Link's just a floatin'. Floatin', floatin', floatin' on the river. Well, it's the sea, but you know, whatever. Semantics, semantics. Link. Link. Wake up, Link. <laughs> Pull yourself together, Link. Um, whoa, I'm on a boat. And what is going on, Link? <laughs> well, have you come to your senses yet? Whoa, you are surprisingly dull-witted. Well, I take insult to that. Whoa, creepy laugh. Do I startle you? I suppose that is only natural. As wide as the world is, I am the only boat upon it who can speak the words of men. How do you know? Have you been to every possible location in the world? No. Link, I've been watching you since you went to the first Aiken Fortress to rescue your sister. I understand how you desire to protect your sister could give you the courage to fearlessly stand up to anything. But such a bold attempt was foolhardy. I suppose you saw him, the shadow that commands that monstrous bird. His name is... Slim Shady. No, it's Ganon. He who obtained the power of the gods attempted to cover the land in darkness and was ultimately sealed away by the very power he hoped to command. He is the very same Ganon, the emperor of the Dark Realm, the ancient legends speak of. I do not know why the seal of the gods has failed, but now that Ganon has returned, the world is once again being threatened by his evil magic. Tell me, Link, do you still wish to save your sister from him? And will you do anything to save her? Of course he will. He's a good brother. I see. In that case, I shall guide you as we go forward, advising you on what you should do and where you must go. Ganon cannot be defeated by human hands, let alone by what little strength you possess. You call me scrawny? The key to defeating Ganon is locked away in a great power which you can wield only after much toil and hardship. Do you understand? Of course. In that case, we depart. To the Great Sea! Ah, but I'm getting ahead of myself. This is actually a bit embarrassing for me to admit, but although I am indeed a boat that possesses the power of speech, I possess no sail. And a boat with no sail can sail no seas. 
I have brought you far to the east of the dark gaze of the Forsaken Fortress. On this island is a town of merchants who deal in a wide variety of goods. How'd you bring me here without a sail? If you search hard enough, surely you can find one that will sell you a sail. I'm sorry to ask of this, but without a sail, I will be useless to you. This island of merchants is home to many valuable goods. While the sale must come first, do not feel limited to buying only it. Once you have it, feel free to stock up on anything else you think you may need. But remember, there is no time to play. Come back here immediately as soon as your errands are done. Well, thanks for telling me I can spend my money on whatever I want. That's so generous of you. Anyway, I'm right at 22 minutes almost, so... I guess I'm going to cut this here, so... Apparently we're on Windfall Island, but... Next time on Let's Play The Wind Waker, we will do more exploration on this windfall island. So until then, this is Homestar92, and I am out.